sing this morning, page number 194. We even got a seat up here for you. Page number 194 in your psalm books today. Page number 194 in your psalm books this morning. number 224, the birthday of a king. Page number 224. Page number 224. In the list Number 222 as you're turning in the bleak midwinter. Page 222 will take care of some birthdays for this week of the 19th through the 25th and some anniversary. We have Jacob Feston on the 19th, Bob Hackett on the 19th, we have Gavin Tate on the 19th, Lauren Latham on the 20th, Cyrus Medlock on the 20th, Waylon uh, Souder on the 20th. Brianna Helfrich on the 20th, Ian Rice on the 21st, and John Hopper on the 23rd, 
Blaine Tate on the 23rd, and on Christmas Day, Abigail Snow. And so that's all the birthdays that we have today. And let's sing to these folks. Happy birthday to you, to Jesus be true. God bless you and keep you the whole year through. Anniversaries goes out to RJ and Audrey Boykin. Are you here this morning? Please raise up. Thank you. How many years? Nine? Years. Nine? Nine. Wonderful. Let's give them a hand this morning. So you're the only ones on the list, so you get it today, all right? Happy anniversary to you, to Jesus be true. God bless you and keep you the whole year through. A big thank you to all who donated to the Veterans Homes gift bags. It was greatly appreciated. Remind you tonight, it will be practiced tonight at 5.30 at, on the 19th, which is today, and the program will be tonight at 7 o'clock. So please attend tonight and support the y'all, the young people, and everyone that's involved in a lot of work, a lot of preparation has gone into it, and I guarantee it will be a blessing to you. And hopefully all the seats will be dry by then, all right? <laughs> so I might want to bring you a trash bag tonight. If you want to sit on a wet seat, just put your trash bag down, all right? Oh, well, you have something to talk about, right? There you go. All right, number 222 in the bleak midwinter. This morning and we'll have a word of prayer with one another today and welcome folks to church today and be a blessing and then brother Dan will come after that with our scripture reading and then we'll get right into our specials this morning and the giving Sunday Heavenly Father we thank you Lord today you'll bless the rest of this service in Jesus name Amen, Amen. turn around great folks today and be a blessing
Brother Dan's going to come and lead us in our scripture reading this morning. Brother Dan's going to come and lead us in scripture reading this morning. And then as he's leading the scripture, the choir will make its way forward. The first uh, vocal we're going to have is the Wilson sisters will be singing, I um, had to re get my glasses on, See Yonder in Major Low. And then Esther Jones will be playing a special or maybe singing, um, whatever it is. Esther, probably not, right? No? Okay. All right. Hark the Herald Angel Sings, what she's going to do all right here in just a little bit. So you... Brother Dan, you come, scripture reading, and then the girls, you be ready to go. John, chapter 3 this morning. Would you stand, please, when you find your place there? We'll read responsively through John 3. There was a man of the Pharisees named Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews. Jesus answered and said unto him, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Jesus answered, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born of water and of the Spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of God. Marvel not that I said unto thee, ye must be born again. Nicodemus answered and said unto him, How can these things be? Verily, verily, I say unto thee, we speak that we do know, and testify that which we have seen, and we receive not our witness. And no man hath ascended up to heaven, but he that came down from heaven, even the Son of Man which is in heaven. That whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have eternal life. For God sent not his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. And this is the condemnation, that light has come into the world, and men love the darkness rather than light, because their deeds were evil. But he that doeth truth cometh to the light, that his deeds may be made manifest, that they are wrought in God. And John also was baptizing in Anan near to Salem, because there was much water there, and they came and were baptized. Then there arose a question between some of John's disciples and the Jews about purifying. John answered and said, A man can receive nothing, except it be given him from heaven. He that hath the bride is the bridegroom, but the friend of the bridegroom, which standeth and heareth him, rejoiceth greatly because of the bridegroom's voice. This my joy, therefore, is fulfilled. He that cometh from above is above all. 
He that is of the earth is earthly, and speaketh of the earth. He that cometh from heaven is above all. And the Lord has seen and heard, and he and no man has testimony. He that has received the testimony hath set his seal that God is true. For we do not sin. The Father loveth the Son, and hath given all things unto his hand. He that believeth on the Son hath everlasting life, and he that believeth not the Son shall not see life, but the wrath of God abideth on him. Thank you. You may be seated. Okay, so if you can help pass out things, well, they'd appreciate your help back there, all right? Thank you, girls. That was such a wonderful song. Esther now is going to play for us, Hark the Herald Angels Sing. And then uh, Maggie Landis has a piano special after that. And then, um, then after that, the choir is going to sing Angels from the Realm of Glory.
amounts of talent in this church. Tell you. Thank you, Maggie. Appreciate it. All right, the choir is going to come now and sing Angels from the Realm of Glory, and Brother Dave's going to come and lead us in that. And then Isabel, she'll have a uh, violin special for us right after that. And then the Camel family has a special. So you guys will be on deck. All right? So. We're going to sing a song here this morning, and then uh, right after that, we have a group that's going to sing Old Beautiful Star of Bethlehem and a few other selections. And then um, Ruth Ann Jones is going to bring us a piano special called Good Christian Men Rejoice, and so give you a heads up a little bit. All right. Bless you.
seek. Take time to be holy. The world rushes on. Spend much time in secret with Jesus alone. By looking to Jesus, like Him thou shalt be. Thy friends in thy conduct, His likeness shall see. Take time to be holy. Let him be thy guide, and run not before him, whatever be tied. In joy or in sorrow, still follow the Lord, and looking to Jesus, still trust in his word. Take to be holy, be calm in thy soul. Each thought and each motive beneath his control. Thus led by his spirit to fountains of love. Thou soon shalt be fitted for service of
That's it. Okay. All right. Thank you. That was wonderful. I love that song. Amen. All right. Uh, Ruth Ann Jones now is going to play Good Christian Men Rejoice. And then the choir will sing next Christmas Grace. Thank 
What a precious song that is this morning. Amen. All right, Reuben Jones has a special this morning, and then Sarah, uh, Reuben's going to uh, play for us Angels We Have Heard on High. So if you come on up, Reuben. And then uh, the first Noel, Sarah. And then the choir will sing Go Tell It on the Mountain. And then we're going to close it out with three, three more songs right after this. So, Reuben. Okay, Reuben just got nicked. There we go. Oh, oh there he is. Ooh, you're quick. Uh, I know most of you probably already know this, and I'm sure not trying to put a damper on the service, but uh, and it's not. But Sister Hope McAllister went home to be with the Lord, and uh, her service is going to be here at the church Wednesday. Uh, the service at two o'clock, uh, visitation at one. But the church is having dinner for her family at noon, and if you'd like to help in that, anybody, ladies, get a hold of my wife Karen. But. Uh, Many of you don't know Hope. She was 97 years old. And Karen and I had the privilege of just sitting at the kitchen table and visiting with her this week. And I really didn't think she was that close to home, but she was. And uh, so her service is here Wednesday at 2 o'clock, visitation at 1, dinner will be at 12. And so if you can be, if you can be here, be here. It'd be encouragement to the family, and I mean that. And I know it's Wednesday and out in the week, but I tell you, uh, my heart is kind of, I don't know how to say it, but I've been buried. I've buried a lot of people that I pastored for a long time. And her and her husband, really, really sweet, sweet people. And uh, anyway, but she's with the Lord. And she's with Les. Amen. I always called them hopeless. Her name was Hope and his name was Les. And I said, Mr. and Mrs. Hopeless. <laughs> but uh, they were a blessing. All right, Reuben.
Thank you, Sarah. Appreciate that very much. All right, the choir is going to come and sing Go Tell It on the Mountain. And then uh, Nehemiah Jones, you'll be up next with We Three Kings. And then uh, we have about three songs left after that. All right. I thought we were going to have to get him a Sears catalog to set on there for a little bit there. You, know? you don't know what that is, why? Anyway. All right. My good. Thank you, Nehemiah. I appreciate that. That's wonderful. All right. The choir is going to come and sing Oh Holy Night. And then we have a group special after that. And the choir will close out with uh, Good Christian Men Rejoice.
I hate to say this, but we've got so many new people here, I don't know everybody's name. I just pretend like I do and pretend like I know you. By the name of Nance, N-A-N-C-E. Is there anybody by that name, Nance? Nance. Huh? 
Would that be some of your? Would that be? Some, there's a there's a card or a gift or something back here. To, who, Debbie? Would it be Debbie? Uh, okay. I don't know anyway. There's a gift somebody's trying to find to give to somebody. I don't know who it is, but I guess if nobody takes it, I'll take it. So it'd be all right. We got that. All right. Okay. We got the. Hey, hey, Terry. Where's Terry? What Terry Coates at? Right here. Come on, Terry. Help. You want to help sing it? And and Dean, you want to help sing? We're singing Prodigal Son. Uh, I want you to get in tight. Come on in here. Swing in. Swing in. Come on in here, guys. We get it. There we go. All right. Dean's going to come and help us. Somebody else wants to come out of it. Danny, you want to come and help us? You're welcome. I don't care. <laughs> this, is, this, is, this is kind of like goulash. We just mix it all up. <laughs> come up close to the mic here, you guys. Oh. <laughs> get in there back and add that, add that bass in, all right? Yeah. Lonnie, hit it and, and we'll go. Okay. We got one more special. Okay, Dean. But I'm not the choir is going to come and sing the last song for today. We want to thank everyone for participating. Thank you for your talents that you've given to the Lord. We pray that this has been a blessing to you. And uh, this choir now will close us out with good Christian men. And then, Pastor, when they were done, turn back over to you. Join us on this one, number 202. Good Christian men rejoice. That's what we're going to do. Yeah. Everybody just join in. Stand together.
If it remains standing, we're going to be dismissed in just a little bit. But why don't we turn to 194 and sing one verse of joy to the world, and then you can turn around, shake hands, tell somebody you love them, and be glad in the Lord, and you go home and enjoy yourself. And I haven't had time to open up all the cards, but I'm going to go home and sit down and open up cards and be thankful. Thank you all for being here today. I hope it's been a blessing to you. And in spite of all the troubles and trials and sorrows of this world, Jesus Christ is still the King of kings, the Lord of lords. He's going to reign one of these days. And all the sorrow and sin is going to be behind us. But if you're not saved, you won't know that. Experience that. We want you to be saved. I hope you'll trust in Christ. If you haven't, just want you to know we love you in the Lord. Let's sing this with every... Now if you don't sing it with everything you've got, we're going to sing two verses. But if you sing it good, the first verse, we'll shut her down. All right. Oh. Just reminded, I listen before we go. Sister DeGase fell last night. She's not doing real good. She, you know, but we need uh, if some of you young ladies or somebody would have a calling on your life, Sister Pitts, she needs somebody in the daytime to stay with her. And uh, we need some help with her. And uh, so if you'd be interested, get a hold of Sister Pitts about uh, helping with Miss DeGase. If you could just do one day, that'd be wonderful if you could stay with her one day. But get a hold of Sister Pitts on that. And I just want to say this, that I do thank all the people in church who serve in so many ways, of taking care of the elderly, helping with the elderly, going and seeing them and doing things to help them. That is a church. That's, that, that's what counts in the end. Amen. All right, here we go. Now do your best. Joy to the world, the Lord is on Four, all right, to close you out. Here we go, verse number four, and we go home. He you joined us today. We have some folks visiting that drove all the way from Atlanta, right, Georgia, to be in the service today. I mean, drove all the way from Atlanta, Georgia. We want to welcome you. Thank you. Appreciate it very much. You're dismissed. Have a wonderful day in the Lord. We'll see you this evening. All right.